What's going on everyone, it's Kieran Webb, the London Barber and today I am going to do a reaction video to Diane Buswell's Cutting My Boyfriend's Hair for the First Time video as you know uh, I cut Joe Suggs hair for him and Diane is uh, well a former hairdresser and I guess that she she's been threatening for a little while that she's going to do it and that she's going to steal him off of me well we shall see. We shall see. This video is going to tell, oh, isn't it, Diane? Hmm? Hmm? All right. I'm going to be stretching, get ready for this one. <clears throat> okay. So, um, I'm going to watch it on the laptop. I'll stick them up here somewhere, probably, if I can get the footage. And then, uh, let's, let's watch the video and... I will give you my honest opinion and reactions to what I watch. I'm quite excited and a little bit nervous as to what his hair is going to come out like, so let's go. Okay. <laughs> okay, so um, what are we here? We're eight seconds in, Diane. Eight seconds, and you've already slapped Joe in the face with your hair. <laughs> Oh yes, yes. This this is gonna be good. This is gonna be funny. Okay, let's go. May I focus? I hope so. Welcome to Diane's Salon. Hello, sir. How are you? Hi, I'm good. Thanks. That's good. Would you like a drink or a coffee? I've already got two drinks. Two drinks? Okay, greedy, man. Don't be greedy. Two drinks. So what are we doing for you today? <laughs> Just cut my hair. <laughs> what colour and a cut, please? It's a, some sort of weird role play. <laughs> Normally in a salon. Can I please have a haircut and colour? Of course. What colour would you like? The colour that you've gone out and bought. <laughs> Joseph is letting me colour, which I've already done before. Mm. I've done it blonde before uh -huh. and I've turned it red before. <laughs> I don't think Joe liked it when his hair was red. His face kind of says that he definitely didn't like it when it was red. <laughs> to be fair though, um, it wasn't quite Diane red, was it? Let's be honest. It was a bit more like a, a gorgeous mulled wine. Anyway, let's continue. But we're going to go with some blonde. But yeah, today. back to blonde. Okay, to so blonde. bleaching. But also, Joseph is letting me do something he's never let me do before. This is a big one. This is a very big deal. Normally, as the, hence why I'm wearing this t-shirt, normally I let the London barber, he's the only person that's touched my hair. This is a big deal. Why are you letting Diane cut your hair? It's my job. Anyway, he's wearing my merch. He is wearing my merch. Um, okay, let me just shamelessly plug the merch site. It's not really a merch site, if I'm honest. It's more just a clothing site. Um, got loads of different designs and stuff on there. I made these designs myself. I think they're pretty cool. And so I, I, I made a website for them. It's um, tlb-clothing.co.uk. That's tlb-clothing.co.uk. It's linked right here. As you can see, this is what the website link is. Uh, that is also linked in the description below. Uh, the t-shirt that Joe is wearing, the, the, he, that's actually his hairstyle. That's his hair, the silhouette of his hair, a style that I did for him for a photo shoot. I took it off and, uh, well, I say I, I never, Alice did it for me. She's a genius. Um, and she took that off and she made it for me and um, that t-shirt is no longer available with the London Barber on it it's now only available with a big yellow triangle around the back of it so it makes the hair stick out and it's a little bit cooler alright so that's tlb-clothing.co.uk enjoy let's continue yeah, for the last god knows how many years and now you finally persuaded me to, to change <laughs> Diane's face when she's holding the scissors like this. That's, that's some scary s***, man. Like, if someone was going to cut my hair and I see him in the mirror, like... Perfect. 
<laughs> oh no, I'm out of here, motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Jeez. Exactly, Kieran, if you're watching this, I know you will be. This is the one-off, uh, pardon me. This is a one-off thing. It's not happening again. Boy. No, it's blooming not happening again. One-off. You're damn right it's a one-off. You really love the way I've cut your hair. I would never cheat on Kieran like that. Do okay. So, Diane says, what if you really love my haircuts? And Joe says, I would never cheat on Kieran like that. But yet you did cheat on me. This is cheating on me. With Diane. Well, in a haircut sense. Anyway, let's continue. Don't, these are, those scissors are actually very sharp. They are actually. You know, mine are quite blunt. I haven't used them for a while. Oh, I've cut care for a while. Okay, people. If you've got a sharp pair of scissors, don't be running your fingers up and down it. Come on, Diane. Jesus. If they were my scissors, you would have cut your finger wide open. Luckily for her, hers were a little bit blunt, she said, but she scared me for a minute there. Very long time. Sweet. There is a special thing that's going to happen while I'm cutting your hair. You are going to be blindfolded. <laughs> <laughs> blindfolded? I'm going to scroll through. What I'm going to do is I'm going to scroll through to where Diane is cutting Joe's hair because, I'll be totally honest, uh, I don't do colour. So there's no point in me reacting to colour because I have no clue what she's doing. I'm going to scroll. I'm going to scroll to the cut, the part we're most interested in anyway. Right, let's do a little bit of scrolling, shall we? I love it, it's so blonde. Let's have a look. Look at you. Mm. Okay, I need a colour. Oh, the colour looks cool. Nice colour, Diane. Very nice colour. Uh, Joe does suit blonde hair, actually. He looks good when he has the blonde in it. I think it looks really cool and it gives him some cool texture. Nice movement and stuff through the hair. Colour can really change. See, this is the thing. I may not know how to do colour, but I appreciate colour. I think colour is super important. And a good cut and colour is very, very important. So if you can do both, that's that's really good. If you're thinking of getting into the trade or looking to become a hairdresser, uh, definitely consider doing both cut and colour because it really will allow you to be able to do a complete look. I, on the other hand, cannot do colour, so I do miss out on a few clients of my own that would like to have colour done. I cannot do their colour for them, which is a shame. Anyway, let's just get back to reacting. Jesus, Kieran, you do like to talk, mate. Wait, but I don't have a comb. <laughs> <laughs> Were you like this when you cut your hair before? Like, I need a comb. Goes back home to get a comb. No you comb have no though. equipment really? no for comb. a hairdresser. This is out, I'm, do you know what? I've given a one star <laughs> review so far. <laughs> she does make me laugh, Diana. Oh, right, here we go. We've only got two blades. What's this? You've got to check to see what, how many blades it has. Skin and bold fading. Balding. You've got a balding set. <laughs> <laughs> Nah, she can't have. That that can't be true. She bought a balding clipper. Oh. Do you, okay, a balding clipper is uh, a clipper that is designed to do exactly what it says on the tin, which is bald your hair. It's basically, it takes it like super tight, super, super tight to the head, so like clean, like clean shaven, basically. That clipper is not the type of clipper that you would use to cut hair in the way that Joe likes his hair to be cut. So this will be very interesting. It only comes with two separate guards, this clipper as well. It comes with a one and a half guard, which is 4.5 millimeters, and a half guard, which I think is like 1.5 or 1.8 millimeters, depending on which brand you buy. Um, so this is gonna be very interesting to see what she does now, because now she only has this clipper, no adjustability. She can't make the lever go up and down to make it shorter or longer. It's gonna be very difficult to uh, to change the lengths, but does that mean she's going to cut it all the way to the top? He may end up with one part, one half all the way. No, no, he can't have. He can't have. Let, let's continue. Oh my God. You bought the wrong shaver. No. It's all what fine. number is that? Let's have a look. This is four point five mil. Uh. All right, Joseph. <laughs> Put the lights on. Hold that for me uh. for a second. Thank God, I thought she was going to not section it for a minute then. She sectioned it. That's good. Diane. No, that's good. That's a good thing. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Skills. See this? This is good. I like it, Diane. I like it. I like it, mate. A little bit of the old flick of the wrist there, creating the little C-curve motion. Sorry. 
for the accent. Um, yeah, actually, this is really good. Uh, when you're when you're cutting with a clipper, the most important thing is to flick where you don't want to create a solid line. So if you do attempt to cut anyone's hair at home yourself, try not to just go all the way up and create a line. Uh, you have to flick out because it creates softness. It, it basically flicks the edges and makes them softer. So good, good start so far, Diane. I'll let's uh, carry on watching. Okay. Okay, so what Diane's done is uh, made basically like a, a guideline around Joe's hair where that's going to be the shortest point. When I do Joe's hair, I start and I make a baseline at the top where I don't want the length to go any shorter at the top than that. And so I start by doing that with clipper over comb and then I work uh, either clipper over comb all the way up to that baseline guide or I attach the guards like what Diane has done and I go up to that guide and I flick out when I get to that guideline. Diane's doing it where she's uh, flicking out and making a guideline all the way around the underneath, which is cool. I guess she's doing that because I don't know. Maybe, maybe she doesn't have any other guards. Your hair's like so okay, cute. Okay, okay. What do you mean my hair's cute? How do you have cute hair? A little old uh, scissor over comb there, I see, Diane. Very nice, very nice. I see you've still got some of your skills from uh, your old hairdressing days. Nice. Scissor over comb's a difficult technique. Well done. Let's continue. Ow, you hit him can you can you sit up to yeah. for me? Thank you. Really? I always do one side better than the other. I always used to find though. Really? Mm. Why? I don't know. It's just like when you curl your hair as well. There's always one side that curls. You shouldn't it's... say that to your customers. <laughs> no. To be fair, do you know I've actually won competitions in my men's hair cutting. <laughs> oh. So Diane, you've won awards. Okay. This haircut better be amazing. If you're an award-winning men's hairdresser. The end result's got to be incredible. Worst haircut. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh my god, Joe. <laughs> he's, he's so mean. World's worst haircut. <clears throat> no! Worst haircut of the year award, <laughs> Diane Buswell. Joseph, I can't believe you even just said that to me. So mean. Oh my god! <laughs> this, it's crazy, right? Because like when boyfriends and girlfriends cut each other's hair, they don't care. They just like dig the comb in the head and push the head around and hurt each other. <laughs> Diane's no different except for she's doing it on camera and uh, digging her comb into Joe's head. Poor boy. I'm a little bit more cautious with him. I don't really stick the comb in his head that much. Ever. Great me eye out. That will do for now. Ooh, I'll let me well, oh, go around the edge. Trendy, I like it. Oh. Looks pretty good. Wait, you were doing you were using the shade okay. ready to go. Let's have a look. Yeah, doing no. the back bit now, I can see the mind? back. <laughs> what have you done? Okay. I can see some imperfections just from a professional's point of view. Um and all this is is just where Diane's gone up to and created a certain weight line. Uh, when you do that, it can be very difficult to then erase that weight line that you've you've applied. So where she's gone up and she's flicked out and she's created that weight line for herself and then scissor over comb. When you're trying to scissor over comb, it can be quite difficult to get that line out. Um, and Joe has a, a, he has one of those really tough head shapes where it's kind of, it goes in at the sides and in in the middle and it kind of dips in and concaves a little bit. So to get into those little uh, areas I always end up having to use the corner of the blade and stuff to to flick out so yeah I mean Diane doesn't cut hair you know for a living anymore so this for me it looks okay it looks pretty good the scissor over comb looks nice I can just see some imperfection in the uh, the weight there but yeah so far good good effort I like it what shape are you making on the back of my neck I'm making an L shape <laughs> Oh, for what? Larry. Loser. Does he ever do your eyebrows as well? No no one touches my eyebrows. Ow! No, I don't do his eyebrows. Do his own eyebrows. Well, I would do his eyebrows, though, if he asked me to. It's not difficult. If you've got big bushy eyebrows, you just put a two guard on and run it over the top. Sort it right out. Oh, scrape me! <laughs> She's oh. really picking him up. <laughs> Stop scraping. You... Zoe did that as well. She just scraped my That's hair. Scrape get a hair spray, okay? Okay. And then we're done. Then we're okay. Done. Oh, thank heavens. To be fair, this looks pretty good. I can't see the viewfinder enough, but I can't work out if it's good or not. I mean, the only thing I would say 
is that the small imperfections, just that little bit of weight that's here at the side where it could be blended and a little bit more cleaner. Um, and Diane kind of took you, you took the crown off a little bit. Maybe went too high on the crown area, but it's all good. Just a little bit too high, just a little bit. Gonna have to probably um, cut it so that it grows back. You missed. Ow! I just squirted heat protection mist in my eye! <laughs> Idiot. Nothing! Heat protection mist in the eye. No, I'm What's fine. the matter with you? You crazy Nothing. Oh, I've just noticed. Joseph still doesn't have that damn picture on the wall. The last time I went to his place and cut his hair, which was a couple of months ago, by the way, uh, that picture wasn't on the wall then either. Look, let me roll that bit of footage for you now so you can see what went down. Ready? Go! Oh, oh. 14 bottles of Jimmy Red Rue on the way. Oh dear, oh, Joseph. Oh dear. <laughs> oh dear. Look at this. What is that? What's this big space over here? Look, Look. at this wonderful space here, people. This is where this should be, but it's not. Why not? Do you know what? I, I actually have. I, I'm waiting for my dad. Dad, oh. <laughs> once again. My dad will see this as well. This is great excuses. Great excuses. That's... But. It's... Look. It's still not on the wall. And you know what? Now, we've done another haircut since that haircut, <laughs> and it's still not there. <laughs> well, the, the Ripper, the guy who did the, the, this art piece, yeah. he's also messaged me saying, like, when, can you, you know, when are you going to sort of post a picture about it? And uh, I said, yeah, obviously, when it goes on the wall, so I haven't got yeah. off the wall yet. Oh, well, there you go. You know, so, you know. It's, not, it's just not the right time. Also, this has got to go up on the wall as well. Yeah. That's got to go up on there, where yeah. the clock is. Yeah. I've just, you know, I've just, I've, just, I've been procrast procrastinating. He hasn't been procrastinating. procrastinating. Let's be honest. Let's be honest. Come on, Sug. Let's be honest. You're a busy boy, right? Oh, yeah, you're exactly. super busy. Why don't you, why don't you you're killing the game. With? You're destroying it. You've got a new job at Instagram, I see. I've, yeah, I've just, I've just got a new job. Got a new job there. <laughs> don't tell YouTube. Thanks for the tick. Uh, so there you go, people. Still, not on the wall. So there you go. There was that little bit of footage of that picture not being on the wall. Unbelievable. That guy, pretending like he needs Daddy Sug to come round and do that for him. Okay, he probably does. So, uh, let's continue. Did you hurt yourself? No, nothing, I'm fine. <laughs> no, what did you do? No, nothing, oh, I just fell. comes with the hairspray. Mm -hmm. Looks I good, you look like that I like it. Of, uh, nice styling. Jim, Jim Carrey. Carrey? Yeah. I'll take that. Jim Carrey. Hello everybody, that looks good. was me oh, damn it, it looks cutting good. and colouring my boyfriend's hair! <laughs> oh, they are cute together. you got to admit, they're really, really cute together. I do like uh, them together. They're, they're a good couple. They make me laugh. They're very sweet and they work well together as a team. I like that. <laughs> Did you enjoy it? Yeah. Do you like it? Yeah. The best haircut I've ever had. Excuse me? The best haircut you've ever had? Nah. No chance. He's got a. I've stopped it, but he's got to say something else, surely. Since before Kieran cut, so I cut my hair. <laughs> Joker. <sighs> You're lucky. You're lucky. I thought I was going to have to kill him for a minute. I thought I've been doing all this work for him, and this is the best hair case I've ever had. I'm joking. Uh. Aww. Kieran, yeah. please come back into my life. <laughs> I need you back, buddy. So, I'll be back. I'll be back, dude. You just give me a call and I'll be back. Finish watching the video. I think that Diane's done a really good job. I think that she's, she's cut his hair nicely. Um, scissor over comb was nice, good technique. <whistles> scissor over comb is not an easy technique to do by any means, so um, Diane's showing that she still has some of her skills left over from where she used to be a hairdresser. Um, yeah, just the small imperfections that I saw were just like blending out that heavy line that she left from the, the balding clipper. But it's really difficult. I give her props, you know. If you haven't got an adjustable clipper, it can be really tough, you know. Like that half guard and that one and a half guard, they won't blend into each other. So she had to try to scissor over comb from the one and a half. Okay. So uh, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Boom. Um, and. Uh, subscribe to the channel I'd really appreciate that and also um, 
Be sure to check out the merch link in the web in the. <laughs> be sure to check out the merch website link below in the description box. Um, and also make sure you go across and subscribe to Diane's channel after you've subscribed to my channel. All right. So I hope you enjoyed yourselves. I bid you a farewell, and hopefully. I'll have another haircut and chat video with Joe Sugg real soon where I can cut his hair and we can discuss this reaction video. Alright guys, I hope you had a good one and I'll see you soon. Peace! Bye! 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 Bye!